Everybody wants to know, how could the ice bath possibly be good for the male reproductive sex hormone if it makes your genitals shrink up into your abdomen? Ben Bickman explains why the ice bath is one of the best things that men can do for their sexual and reproductive health because insulin resistance is often the first sign of erectile dysfunction. An erection requires the blood pressure that the heart manufactures to engorge the penis with blood. How does that happen? Upstream of the penis, you gotta dilate the blood vessels to let the blood flow in freely. But downstream of the penis, you gotta constrict the blood vessels so that all of that pressure has nowhere to go. So what does the ice bath do? It improves your insulin sensitivity by activating your brown fat, by clearing glucose from your bloodstream, by helping to restore your mitochondria. And it turns out that insulin sensitivity is directly correlated with erectile dysfunction because it is the endothelial cells inside those blood vessels that signal vasoconstriction and vasodilation. The constriction and dilation is controlled by smooth muscle tissue that wrap right around the endothelial cells. When the endothelial cells are insulin resistant, they cannot produce the nitrous oxide to the smooth muscle tissue that controls blood flow. So here's why the ice bath is one of the best things you can do for male reproductive health. You improve your insulin sensitivity, you're helping your endothelial cells get the energy they need to make nitrous oxide or releasing the smooth muscles for vasodilation so that your circulatory system is working properly and you can maintain an erection.